drone up just so I could do some shots of the boat going up the river, or down the river. And there was about 30 odd seagulls trying to knock a drone out of the sky, so I had to get it down. So that's why the footage I've just put on the video then is pretty short and sweet. But anyway, not far from the mouth of the river now, so I'll catch you in a bit. outside. Southampton water and um, get some drone footage because it'll be a lot easier to fly the drone and land the drone with the seats being so rough so let's do that Size of that. 
line purely because it didn't go all the way over the cows but then there's probably not much point um, and it just to turn up just to turn around and go back again back in coming into the river handball now um, at the drone up I think I've got some good videos so I'll wait and see and we can have a look well you'll know because you've just seen them um, but there was a couple of times where I think the drone couldn't work out the uh, the height obviously the, on the drones they have a minimum sort of altitude that they'll fly to and I think it was struggling with the water because a couple of times it was probably no more than a meter off the water uh, so yeah got it back luckily and now just heading back down to the moor into tie her back up and give her a wash down me back on the mooring it was a good little run actually didn't get to go over the Isle of Wight in the end just because it was a little bit rough and I wanted to do a bit more drone videos um, but yeah ne the next one we are planning on going down to the needles do a bit of fishing uh, I say we because it'll be my friends Lee and Pom and myself um, yeah do a bit of fishing it should be a good one so I'll take you along for the ride for that one thanks a lot for watching cheers bye